guys, welcome back once again. For those of you new here, my name is Evie and welcome. Today we're playing a little bit of Animal Crossing. Now you guys on this channel have not seen me play Animal Crossing before. I play it every single time that I stream. That's the way that I start stream. So if you guys do like Animal Crossing, please feel free to come join my stream. I stream Monday, Wednesday and Friday, 8.30 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. I will of course leave a link down below as well if you guys are interested in following. Now today, very sadly, one of my villagers have left. I say very sadly, it was Caroline. Bless her. She was a sweetie. She just didn't really fit my vibe. She was like a hot Cheeto colored squirrel. Now, I mean, I'm not too picky with who I have on my island, but now this has opened up a lot of space and I need to find a villager. Last time somebody left, I had somebody in my campsite that day, which was June, which was very nice because June's a cutie. June's house, however, not a cutie. Um, so I ended up going on a couple of little island tours, didn't find anyone I like, and invited June over. But today, alas, there's nobody in my campsite that I can fall back on. So I've got to commit. I've got to fully commit to this. Which means I'm going to buy 10 Nook Miles tickets and we're going to go on an adventure. For those of you that are new to Animal Crossing and I'm not too sure what I'm talking about, Nook Miles tickets give you a one-way ticket, a one-way ticket, no, you can return, a ticket to a one-off island. So this island, once you go there, you can't go back. Once you leave, anything you leave on that island, including a villager that you might like, you may never see again. So that being said, there is roughly, I think, 400-ish, give or take, Animal Crossing characters that you can come in contact with. So, I mean, I feel like 10 is not many, but it also, it's going to be a fair few. So we're gonna cross our fingers, cross our toes, that we get somebody semi-cute. I'm more of an attitude kind of person. I say that. I feel like I'm gonna be really picky. I don't really like any of the hippo style ones. Well, none of the hippos that I've come across I like. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the horses, although there is Julian, which is this stunning unicorn that has an amazing astrology house that I saw at one of my other friend's islands that I'd happily settle for, because he's a character. So let's just jump straight on in. I'm just buying my tickets as we speak. Uh... I think I want about 10 of them. I think that's probably the best way to go. I'm not going to fully rummage the islands like I usually would when I go there, but I will do a little bit of a... I don't have much wood, so I might try and cut down some trees while I'm there. But, well, look, we'll see how we go. Okay, so I've actually bought five tickets so far. I'll use the five first, and then I'll buy another five. Okay, so I've decided... Now, hear me out. To make this a little bit, uh, a little bit more challenging, because I don't necessarily just want to find a villager that I like. I'm going to, for every villager, pick a number between one and six and then roll a dice and see how we go. If the dice rolls on the same number that I have guessed, I will, of course, choose that villager and they will have to move in to my island regardless of whether or not I, I like them. I want to fly, Orville. Take me away. Time for takeoff. I think I've got everything. I just emptied all my pockets because I just bought a... I think the correct term is shit ton of turnips. Uh, I think I spent 400,000, which I realize people have spent more, but I spent like 400,000 on turnips, which sounds redonkulous. Go catch some bees and chop some trees. Yes, sir, will burr. Oh my God, who is this? I can kind of see them. I'm like, let me get up. Oh my God, the suspense is killing me. It's a cow! I mean, I'm kind of here for the cow, not gonna lie. She kind of looks cute. Sometimes they look really cute and then you go to talk to them and they have some weird sayings and it's just like... Norma, what a cutie. It must be true what they say about how travel broadens your horizons. This change of scenery is giving me a new perspective on life. Back on my island, I like it well enough, but... Okay, so I'm gonna pick five. Let's roll this dice. Got a two! God damn it. Okay. We're not off to a great start, so I hear ya. Well, it was nice knowing you, Norma, but we outta here. Gimme, gimme, gimme that, gimme that wood, gimme that, gimme, gimme that. Okay. I really just want the actual wood, not the soft wood, not the hard wood. Oh, god damn it. I should have known. You know what? I should have known. Okay, hi-ho, let's go. Let's get on to the next island. Wilbur, where is you? Norma was actually so cute. I'm kind of miffed about that. Goodbye, Wilbur. I'll see you in literally two seconds. 
Okay, island number two. Let's do this, shall we? Let's catch some bees and chop some trees, Wilbur. Oh, no, no, no. It's a mouse. I don't... I don't think I'm a fan of the mouses. Excuse me. Can you... Thank you. Kinda cute, though. Candy. I didn't expect to see anyone on this island, too. Somebody tres cool who's from there. Oh my god, that's me, Candy. You silly daffodilly. Oh, she wants to be a pop star. I don't know if I can handle this. I feel like I've had one previously. So let's see, shall we? Let's roll another dice. I'm gonna go three. Six. Okay. I mean, I'm not miffed about that at all. I'm okay with that. Good luck relaxing, Candy. It was nice meeting you, I guess. But catch a... Oh, by the way, I'm in a vampire jacket with fishnets on and no pants. If you were wanting to style the same look, that's what's happening here. God damn it, I knew it was going to be here. I'm going to faint now. Unless... No, I can't get it out in time. I could have attempted to. But I did. Just give me goddamn normal wood. I don't ask for much. I've got a ridiculous amount of hardwood and softwood. For some reason, this game refuses to give me normal wood. I don't know. Is that the same for everyone else? Damn it! Of course my axe broke. Okay, that looks like it's the end of the line because I can't be bothered going and get another axe. A proper axe. Before the next island. So let's go, Wilbur. Okay, let's go, Orville. Round three. I know, like, knowing my luck. No, I don't want to visit Harv's Island. No, that was a mistake. I feel like knowing my luck... I will guess and roll the same number. No, I don't want visitors either. Oh my god, I'm too distracted. Oh, <laughs> uh, why can I not multitask? Okay, give me two seconds. I want to fly. Okay, I feel like I've got semi-cute villages so far. And I know that knowing my luck, I will guess the same number. On like the, in the nicest way possible. Ugliest villager. Or the grumpiest, or some kind of strange villager. That's just my luck. Don't think that me not liking the appearance of a villager is going to make me love them any less. I love all of my villagers. And, ooh, apples. That means I can raid this island for the apples as well, put them in my pockets, and make some cash money. I will be chopping no trees and catching no bees. So no... <laughs> Excuse me? That's Norma again! How did- That doesn't seem right. Who have we got? King of the Craft Marshal. I was taking a shower this morning and a recipe came to me out of thin air. Or steam. Really? Sure, I could have kept it to myself, but self-praise can only go so far. It's time to become a DIY legend. Okay, what have we got? Ironwood cart? Yes! Okay. I love the ironwood recipes. I feel like most people do. They're like the most sought after ones. And I'm slowly but surely, <gasps> come, on, come back to me, getting my hands on all of them. Excuse me, I was talking to you. Norma, excuse me. I feel like this is the game giving me a second chance with Norma. Okay, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna guess one. Two. The dice, the dice god server decided that Norma will not be coming to my island today. But let's shake some trees, shall we? Let's get the apples, because apples can go for some cash money. Each tree with apples on it here will give me $1,500. Now that's a bit of cash. I'm so, I'm just on a high from that ironwood cart, to be completely honest. 5,000, 5,000, 5,000. Okay, so we've got like almost 20 grand worth of apples. Just a casual amount. I'm literally who they write math equations about. This is the lady that had $20,000 worth of apples in her pockets. I can't believe out of three islands I got Norma twice. That seems bizarre to me. Okay, Orville. Let's do round four. Okay, hi-ho, let's go. Kind of nervous. 
Okay, so there is a villager here. What is that? <laughs> Olaf, I swear to God. I love you and hate you at the same time. Although his catchphrase seems to be whiffer and kind of weirds me out. Okay. <laughs> Let's let the dice decide, shall we? I love his fluffy tail, though. What is he meant to be? An anteater? Okay, I'm going to guess four. Six. I mean, I'm kind of... Kind of bummed about that. Well, it was fun while it lasted, Olaf. Have fun on this island. I'm just going to check, make sure that there's no message in a bottle. <gasps> message in a bottle. Okay. What's this one going to be? I've grown weary of the run-of-the-mill furniture, so I've designed a DIY furniture recipe sure to inspire. It would be cruel of me to keep this recipe to myself, so I'm sharing. Do please consider making it. Your muse, Eloise. God, the DIYs on this little hunt are incredible. A golden seat to go with my golden armor and my golden wallpaper. Let's check these bad boys out. Oh, hell yeah. That is a throne fit for a king. Okay, Orville, we had no luck on this island. I mean, not Orville. Wilbur, let's go. Olaf looks like an absolute character. And although I didn't really like the thought of an anteater, Olaf looks fucking wicked. So, I mean, I'm kind of hoping they pull a Norma and give him to me twice. And hopefully I'll give him the second time. Yes, Orville. Yes, I'm ready for takeoff. Please. What would dodos do? Because all I can think of is that scene from Ice Age where the dodos all jump over the edge of a cliff because of a watermelon. So I'm going to say they're not the smartest critters in the sky. Oh my lord. I can see him in the distance. I don't know how I feel about this one. Okay, let's go. Rory. I don't know how I feel about Rory. Ugh. Although a lion would be kind of cool. Capital? Now that just reminds me of the Hunger Games. What have we got? What did we roll last time? We rolled a six last time, so let's go a five. Another six has been rolled. Okay. Rory, it was nice while it lasted. Thanks, but good luck. Peace out. <laughs> I am out of here. Wilbur, start the plane. Actually, let me check the beaches. T I take that back, Wilbur. Just hold on a minute. Oh my god, is there a message on the bottom on all of the islands and I just missed the first one? Or not? Let's see what we've got here. This new DIY recipe was inspired by a scene in a novel I'm reading right now and really enjoying. I entrust my recipe into the sea in the hopes that somebody makes it. I'd love for you to try it out. Wishing you well, Ellie. Log decorative shells? I also don't have this one. They're actually really cute. I'm kind of here for that. I feel like that might be what anchovy has on my island. Okay, now Wilbur, start the plane. Quick, quick, quick. Let's run. Let's get out of here. Actually, I think I need to go get another couple of... Oh, whatchamacallit? It's, yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nook Miles tickets. That's the correct word, in case anyone was wondering what I was trying to say. So after, if I get to the 10th ticket and I still haven't guessed correctly, I'm just going to have to accept them. Because otherwise I could theoretically be doing this forever. <laughs> and I don't know if I want to be doing this forever. So the 10th ticket, regardless of who they are, I have to accept. I'm kind of hoping I get Olaf on the, Olaf, Olaf. Let's have an Olaf about it. Olaf on the last ticket because as much as it was a strange critter. Kinda liked him, not gonna lie. Alright, we're two down and docked on Target Island. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar is go. Oh my god, that's Dodo. <laughs> Obviously, I'm a doodle brain. Okay. Kind of scared. Oh my god, it's a chicken. I swear to god. I can't handle the chickens in this game. Although I do like the jumper that they're wearing. Okay, so let's go see if I can find if I could get through that little bit of tree. See if there is a message in a bottle first. 
before we potentially invite a chicken to our island. Dear soon-to-be best friend, I was taking a shower this morning and a recipe came to me out of thin air. Or steam, really. Like all my best ideas, I stuck it into a bottle and let fate take over. It's time to become a DIY legend. You're welcome. Raymond. Ooh. Raymond is a fancy boy. We do like Raymond. Although that is the same note as before. Wooden double bed. I don't think I've learned that one either. We are cashing on the DIYs today. I mean, if for no other reason other than the DIYs, this has been a fun time. Why does this chicken look so scared? Egbert. I know. Uh, okay, let's let fate decide. Okay, so the last roll was a six. I'm going to go a five again. Four. Oh, the relief. Sounds lovely. But peace, Egbert. I'd like to say it was nice while it lasted, but was it? Other than your jumper, I, I think I'm, I'm out of here. Boink. Boink. Wilbur, start the plane. I am ready. Okay, so I can't remember exactly. Is this island number seven? Question mark? Maybe. Let's see. Okay, I can see a flame. That means that somebody is here. Oh my lord. Is that an angry penguin? I mean, I'm kind of here for it, but those demonic eyes are terrifying. Hopper. I really don't want Hopper. Okay, so the last dice roll was a number four, so let's go a number three, shall we? Five. Okay, well that was a relief, because I don't want you, Hopper. I'm sure you're a lovely person. But peace. <laughs> I'm out of here. It's those, I think it's the red eyes that scare me the most. Kind of really reminded me of the um, penguin from Happy Feet. I'm going to chuck a picture up if you guys don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, we are on island number eight, which means that we've got, for some reason, apples again. So I'm not mad about that because that means we'll get some more cash money. So let's get onto this. Let's go see who we've got, shall we? I'm kind of nervous. I feel like I saw green. It's a bird! But what kind of bird? We'll have to check it out in a minute. I can see it over in the far corner. Message in a bottle. I dreamed I was an ultra super big time master of DIY. Here's the recipe I made in my dream. I thought it smelled good. So I want to share that smell with you. And if you make it, scream. I made it. From Rex, a.k.a. A.k.i. <laughs> a.k.a. DIY man. What did you give me? A water pump? It smelled good? I have questions for you, Rex, but that's- I'll talk to you about it. I'll talk to you about it later. Um, hello? Where is you? Oh, you're over there. You literally must have been, like, right beside me. <gasps> Jakey? I don't mind. I don't mind this one, but I've already got so many birds. Okay. Let's- Let's let the dice decide. Okay, so, roll to five. Let's go a two. Another five again in a row? Okay. Jakey, it was nice. Sounds lovely. But you're not invited to mine, Jakey. Jackie, Jakey. Mm, why am I feel like it's Jakey, but... So what have we got? Two islands left with little to no luck. Obviously, I am no good at guessing numbers. Like, I've got a one in six chance. And here I am <laughs> on number eight with a no luck guessing. Okay, two islands left. I'm not... I feel like I'm not holding much hope. You know, I feel like we're going to get to number 10 and I'm going to have to just accept who it was. I don't know if I know this one. Waterfall just there? Or have I already been to this one today? Maybe I have. Okay, let's go see. Where is our message in a battle? It's so not on this side. This one does seem... Like, it seems very foreign to me, this island. I don't know if I've been to one this size. Have I? Maybe I have. I'm not seeing a message in a bottle. I don't think there was a message in a bottle. How dare they? Ripped off. Filbert. Filbert's kind of cute. Okay, Filbert, let's roll this dice. Let's see whether or not you're invited. Let's go a number four. And number six. Okay, we did not get Filbert, which means, of course, that I have to select... I have to invite. 
whoever is on the next island to my island. I'm I'm actually mildly <laughs> terrified that I'm gonna get Oh my god! No! Damn it! I accidentally pressed it! I invited Philbit. Ah! Uh, I hate myself. I'm so angry right now. Okay, now because I definitely wasn't meant to have Philbit, I quickly shut down my switch and restarted it in the hopes that that would cancel out Philbit. And it looks like it's worked. So there's no sold sign on my nooks. On that little nook sign, I've got one ticket left. My god, that was panic stations for a minute there. I was like, of course. Of course I'd accidentally press move to my island. Like an absolute doodle brain. So we're going to go on our last and final adventure. I feel like these trees are looking extra more orange today. I feel like maybe they're slowly getting ever so slightly crispier. So we're going to go to our final island. So if you wonder why there was a small jump between me realizing I'd pressed the button and invited Philbert to my island and now it's because I freaked out and <laughs> quickly shut off my switch. Like an absolute nink and poop. So let's do it. Let's go on our final one. <laughs> I can't believe I managed to do that. I'm such an idiot. Let's use our last Nook Miles ticket and let's let's see who we've got. If it's like Norma for the third time, I'm 100% here for this. Also, if they throw Olaf back at me, I'm 100% here for that. I still can't believe I said to fill a bit to move in. But there's no sold sign, so I think I must have caught it just in time. Oh, why am I like this? Why am I like this? This is a different looking island. I don't think I've said... Maybe they've updated some of the islands. I don't recognize this one at all. Okay, there is no message in a bottle over here. Let's check this side before we go and see who our final... Final villager might be. Now I'm actually kind of scared. Okay, there's no message in a bottle. There is definitely a villager. It looks like Olaf again. <laughs> like, look at the little... I'm not going to go any closer. But that... That looks like Olaf to me. Olaf, you son of a bitch. <laughs> How did I manage to get you? I got two villagers twice. And I'm not even mad about this. Olaf looks like an absolute stud. Like, I was mildly kidding when I said, I hope it's Olaf or Norma, because I didn't expect them to throw two villagers at me twice. But here we are. Here we are. Here we are. And we got Olaf. I mean, I love the strange characters, so I am 100% here for Olaf. And he's extra fluffy tail. I feel like I haven't got any villagers that have it. Yeah, Caroline did have a tail. But not one that moves like that. I'm so here for this, I'll laugh. Although Whiffer gets me a little bit. Just, just give us a whiff, eh? I'm actually, I'm pretty happy with Olaf, I'm not gonna lie. I thought I'd be like a big old no-no, but I'm kind of here for it. Look at this absolute hunk of spunk. I'm so happy with Olaf. Look at him, he's such a character. <laughs> okay, let's go back to my island. Let's hope that Olaf can move in tomorrow and it all be joyous shall we i hope olaf's house is wicked and i can see the sold sign on it already hell yeah okay this is going to be olaf's new house i'm so excited i actually really enjoyed that so <laughs> i actually had such fun doing that i can't believe i nearly got philbin in i'm so much happier with olaf than philbit that was such a close call i'm an absolute nincompoop i do this all the time but I hope you guys did enjoy this video as well. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe so you do not miss out when I upload next. Thank you guys once again and I'll see you next time. Bye!